Hey there beautiful people, good morning from Dhaka, Bangladesh. Welcome back to the channel. I'm planning to do a few videos for you. Uh, I have a couple of ladies fragrances today and I have one list. Hopefully I'll be able to finish them. I have a very long day ahead, a lot of uh, work to be done. Uh, at the same time, you know, I hope, uh, you know, I can manage all the work. So here we go. So time it's around on the dot 8 a.m. I woke up about one and a half hour back. Uh, it was very tiring day yesterday, three days back to back. I'm having very busy days. Uh, and then, you know, I'm trying to take plenty of rest and you know keep my energy level up right so today we'll be reviewing a fragrance called green cactus for her okay and this is from house of united colors of benetton okay so this house can get confusing because there's a lot of uh, united uh, colors fragrances different lines you know and these are on the budget side so this one is for women and i have reviewed previously like i think this is uh, 2023 release and i do own the previous uh, previously this version okay this version is united colors of benetton green cactus for men i'll keep it here they look like next to each other nice colorful pink and uh blue so blue for men pink for her it like looks cute so i'll let you know everything you know, need to know about it i'll keep the review shorter and uh, if I'll, I'll tell you if it's similar to something if it's worthy picking up and i think this fragrance actually is very good summer release uh, definitely worthy of checking out if you're on a budget looking for a good fragrance and i think this is a fragrance men can also use okay so previously the green cactus for men uh, the difference between the two okay first thing both the bottles look good but i think the men's one look nicer with the cap second thing i really think this one is an advantage is that 100 ml okay they give you 100 ml for dudes and 80 ml for women first thing i don't like about women's fragrances on most part this is unfair okay uh, this one is edt this one is edt both right so why you know 20 ml less juice for the ladies you know that i cannot figure out i don't like that and i personally think the green cactus for him this fragrance uh, it makes better sense and as a thing to notice is the like i like the name cactus the they sort of trying to are trying to tell you this fragrance is going to be fresh you know something green citrusy summer wear and that's exactly what they are so the cactus for men was very unique soothing green light fresh very wearable fragrance and i definitely liked it a lot it's like house of antonio banderas or some of the other house like carl lagerfeld uh, good value for money but on sub part their performance are not that great that's the one thing people have issue let's see the women's version the box looks like this okay you can just take a look it's their logo here pink very girly feminine i like that cute and they have few things set at the back i don't want to bother reading them that's how that looks and the bottle looks kind of okay as a wooden cap and everything the bottle is kind of smaller compared to the men's one and it says the name the house the cap cap has the engraved uh, logo of the brand and then at the back i think you find a sticker and batch and all that okay so this one it's kind of snug fit i think yeah you can pick it up but not quite convinced about the overall you know uh like how do you say snug fitness okay so sprayer works all right let's spray some of my hand on my hand i sprayed it here previously sprayer works all right good good spray okay so this one is a 2023 release and not many reviews on these because these are houses maybe people don't get sponsored or get for free so people don't review i think that's my best guess and this one has notes like cactus bergamot plum thanks to fragrantica uh, middle notes are nectarine jasmine freesia then base notes are amberwood cedar and musk so you see the notes breakdown you get worried like oh there's some dark notes you know like some woody notes uh, is it like very dark this is a very fresh fruity floral citrus kind of a fragrance the moment i smelled it first fragrance it reminded me of uh, is a fragrance called dolce and gabbana light blue for women my bottle is almost finished this is the edp version edt all have this nice citrus bamboo sort of vibe so instead of bamboo they said there's a cactus note in there if you ever really smell cactus cactus if you break it open you know there are many kind of cactuses there are certain things called cactus juice you know i tried that and then i actually accidentally stepped on a cactus in my childhood <laughs> it was very painful because of the thorns and all that you know uh, so i am familiar with the smell of cactus it's kind of like a fresh uh, like a aloe vera you know like a jelly kind of a smell which is very refreshing and it's kind of green obviously you expect that and it's cooling right so this fragrance also will do the same for you very very beautiful in terms of smell i'll tell you uh, this one is more interesting than the men's one men's one it gets a little bit masculine this one definitely has the unisex vibe men can also pull it off 
just a nice little perfume if you can get it for discount i think it can come up to 25 bucks maybe in the other shops so in 30 dollars it stops so apart from the 80 ml juice everything else is just nice about this fragrance okay if you are used to wearing versace menu fresh like for dudes or you like wearing Mont Blanc star walker uh, this fragrance you know like light blue women this fragrance will be right up your alley some people compare this with i think fragrantica sea salt and i don't know what's that fragrance from wait let me check it got compared to jo malone wood sage and sea salt okay so i smell that fragrance but i'll tell you it has some elements of it it's not exactly the same it's the same vein or same uh, you know like a uh, type and then they say my way by armani i don't think at all it smells like my way at all because my way is sweet very intense whereas this is kind of like ozonic light aquatic citrusy and that the the composition of it is very beautiful i smell something like a lotus like a floral which makes it feminine okay so guys if you are looking for ultra masculine fragrance perhaps this is not it you should go for this one okay the men's one but i think as a pair they did an excellent job i'll tell you they are a good fragrance if you are like husband and wife or you know your couple boyfriend girlfriend and you know maybe you're a young couple are you just like or maybe just looking for a budget fragrance this is something you can buy together and it looks nice next to each other nice packaging colorful affordable so the negatives longevity this is not going to push more than two hours on me after two hours is very faint i can hardly detect it so keep that in mind you, you need extra sprays and reapplication every two to three hours apart from that i have no issue and that 80 ml that's that's one thing i don't like men's one good uh, the 100 ml okay so overall my rating on this one the smell is very very pure very citrusy juicy and uh, green little bit and then drinkable kind of you know like ck1 summer flankers this is very refreshing and you know i think this will be very good for daily wear you can keep this bottle in your purse if you're a girl and i think this will be a good fragrance to carry everywhere just spray spray liberally before entering a room or restaurant or work you'll bring fresh vibes with you okay so overall green cactus both of them deserve good marks even though performance is lackluster but price is good smell is nice bottle design is cute i give this one 8.5 out of 10 okay check it out green cactus for her by united colors of manhattan uh, for her okay take care have a nice day bye bye